Hello, I'm Brian with Celestron's product development team, and I would like to show you how to set up the CGXL mount and tripod. Along the way, I'll show you some tips and tricks on how to more easily and quickly set up your mount. Set the tripod upright and unbuckle the strap around the leg. Wrap it around the leg so it's not a trip hazard later. This tripod is rather heavy and stiff because it's made to support so much weight, so I find it best to pull each leg out a bit at a time in even amounts. Remove the lock nut and remember to keep the washer. Slide the accessory tray over the central column. Make sure it's high enough to clear these threads. Now add the lock nut and washer. Apply a good amount of tension here to make sure the tripod legs are extended evenly. All three sides of the accessory tray should come in contact with the tripod leg. Extend the height of the tripod if needed. Level the tripod if needed, but don't worry about making it perfect. Leveling an EQ mount is actually not critical. Using the carry handles, place the EQ mount onto the tripod. Remove the captive Allen wrench, conveniently stored, under the rear carry handle and attach the three bolts to secure the EQ mount to the tripod. Make sure all three bolts are secure. Before more weight is added, roughly pull or align the mount to minimize your adjustments later. Thread the azimuth adjustment knobs into the mount. Keep the RA lock lever unlocked. Thread the counterweight shaft into the CGXL mount. Add your counterweights. Then proceed to lock the RA lock lever. Add your optical tube. I always do this with the deck saddle in the home position. This way I'm better able to brace myself behind the OTA and it slides onto the dovetail saddle evenly. For large optical tubes, we recommend that you have someone help you at least spot the position of the optical tube to make sure that it's securely attached to the mount. After locking the dovetail saddle, I give the connection a quick check before letting go of the optical tube. Now I'm going to balance the mount in right ascension. Now I'm going to balance the mount in declination. Plug in your hand control and power and you're ready to start.